you guys don't recognize this field now, you're crazy. After watching the last video in this video, this is the field that we mowed and we tetted on video. And uh, my windsock always gets messed up. And now we're gonna rake it. So yeah, Dad, Uncle Billy was already hauling bales. That was my plan to do for today. But since he's already doing it, we're gonna let him keep at it and we're gonna rake hay. We got this field and another field and that's all the hay raking for first cutting of 2020. There's oh, uh, yeah. two things we gotta do to this rake. We push this wheel so that it going this way, that wheel swivels. And then we come over here and there's a kind of pin and latch system in here. And it's got different notches and we're gonna go to this notch. And that brings it out the front out. And then the back wheel doesn't swivel, it's a fixed wheel, but it's got adjustments. And we'll probably bring this one to either the second or third hole, and that brings the back of the rake out. The raking is done, but before we can bale, those last two fields had a few green areas in them, so we have to sit and let them dry out. So now I am helping Uncle Billy pick up bales. I am running the skid loader right now. He is waiting for a farrier actually up at his house, so I am loading this truck and taking the skid loader back to the farm to put the bales away. And he meets me at the farm with the truck, and then we both move on to the next field and finish it up. So if you can't tell just by looking at me, I am really tired right now, but I'm still gonna go out and bale another field of hay. I, me and Uncle Billy hauled a bunch of bales home, and uh, we're at 79 bales so far for first cutting. That's pretty good. Uh, hopefully we'll be well over 100 by the end here. We got two fields left. The one should get 25 to 30 bales, I think. And the other one, 10, hopefully. And uh, so I'm going to head out, finish the day off baling hay, and then we'll be coming back tomorrow and doing more baling and probably more hauling for bales. Okay, so we just finished this field, and we got 19 bales off of it. A little bit of one in the chamber that I'm going to dump off at the farm. So once I dump this bale, the counter will say 99 bales for first cutting of 2020. Guys, I have forgotten to mention, you guys have probably seen these wireless earbuds in my ears. I cannot remember the brand right offhand, but I have been using them for the past week. And they come in this little case. They're almost identical, the case and the earbuds, to AirPods, but they are only $30 through Amazon. And I have left a link down in the description down below if you want to get your own pair the sound quality is amazing and it's got great features on it like when i flick this case open when the airpod when the earbuds are in it as soon as i flick that case open they're connected to my phone pull them out as soon as i put them back in here and close the lid they shut off start charging themselves off the case and uh disconnect from my phone and there's a port on the bottom of the case to charge them and they hold charge for 36 hours the case does uh, the earbuds last probably around six to seven hours I want to say maybe more than that I have used them a good day mowing hay on the 4020 and so like during lunch I'll just pop them back into the case let them charge up and they're good for the rest of the day really great highly recommend them links in the description if you want your own You guys just saw our brand new Laley Tine Weeder. Half of it, half of it. The other half is laying right back here. I'm terrible at using the camera. Right over there. I don't know if you guys saw that or not. But that's the other 8 feet piece. It's supposed to be 16, but we cannot get the other tines from Laley. Dad is really mad about it because we ordered this thing back in February, like I said before and we still don't have all the pieces. So dad is having to dink around with a little eight foot tine weeder. 
We're gonna be tying weeding for a while with eight feet. 16 feet, we could do it all in a day, but eight feet. We're trying to race the rain that's coming tomorrow and with half the equipment. But Uncle Billy is hauling in bales from that field that we did yesterday. I got here too late to do that. And the 4960 is not warming up. It is cooling off, technically. Uh, in the winter time, you want your engines to warm up. In the summertime, you want your cabs to cool down. Just finished the field. We got 43 bales right on where I said we'd be, 40 to 50. 43, so we are at 142 bales. Or, no, that 140, yeah, 142 bales for the season. For first cutting in 2020, so awesome. Now we just gotta take the baler back to the farm and wash it and wax it. Like, comment, subscribe.